Hi, this is Erin, and I'm going to show you how to move the now around the WeBots world. So here's the now. I am first just going to actually delete him. So I select him and then press this minus button. And then I'm going to, depending on uh, which object you chose in the you choose in the world, and when you press this button, the now will show up below. Like. I don't want him to be down here. I want him to be kind of listed at the top. So I'm going to add him, find him, and press add. And you can't see the you can't see the now very well, but anytime a new object is added to the world, um, the object's placed at the origin. So I'm just going to move these tables out of the way with the scene tree so you can see it moved over there and I want to do the same thing with that so here's the now um, now because his arms I mean I'll t I guess I'll just show you so if I bring him up like this he kind of knocks him and he falls over so even when I press the control Z, he basically is in that same position and he moves back to the origin. So I'm just going to pretty much, it, I don't know if I could use the controls to actually fix him right. So what I've found to do is that I just have to delete him and add him again. So I'm going to sometimes it's a little bit hard to get a nice view of what you want to do. So I'm going to move him so that he is under the table completely and then slowly raise him up. Okay, so he still fell. I'll have to try that again. Okay, maybe now I'll have a better view of him. And see, part of the reason why I'm showing you this is because it actually is kind of hard to do. It's, it's easy to mess up. So he ran into the table out there. I might just move this chair. Oh, I'm just making everything fall. Okay. All right, so I was able to move it up properly. Let's see if I can move this stupid chair. No. Right. Okay, so I was actually able to move that chair up. So now I'm just going to move back the table to where it was. And do the same with this table. here and um, so the now kind of has a weird stance right now and I'm actually going to use another controller that I have to give him a better stance so that's called now auto movements and as soon as we run it he's going to walk or he should and he does and when I'm running this screencast the now controller or the now simulation just runs a lot slower. 
So he's going to get to the end. I think he rocks maybe about a meter or two forward. And then um, he'll stop. And then he's going to wave very slowly. And then as soon as he's done waving, he puts his arm down. So I am actually now going to save the now in this position. So I'll press save. It's going to warn me. And I'm just going to call this now standing on the conference table. I'm going to replace it. So there it is. I showed you how to move the now and um, hope you learned something. Bye bye.